Hey, I'm at another Upper Peninsula Lake here in Michigan. This one is High Banks Lake. It is an 18 acre lake. It's not very big to have rainbow trout all through it. It's a deep lake. I'm looking forward to fishing it. Let's have some fun. Oh man, there's fish on the bottom now. I'm going down. I'm putting a crawler down. What's the legal rainbow size? I don't want to look up what the legal keep size of a rainbow trout is before I catch one. It just turns out badly. Got one. Decent. I don't know what it is. <gasps> yeah! Rainbow. <laughs> yeah. Hi, buddy. Look at this thing. My first rainbow trout. <laughs> I can't believe it. It's awesome. By far, it's my personal best because it's my first rainbow trout. But uh, what I did was I marked, I was, I was floating around looking for the fish because there's no hard, it's a hard bottom on this lake and it's only 18 acres. You float long enough, you're going to find what hole they're in. And when I found the hole, I just dropped a Bobby Garland down there and look at this.
Well, I'm back out on Lake Michigan. Trying to get used to it. It's calm, calm enough night that I feel comfortable coming out doing some fishing on it. I've never paddled to this island. And I've been camping here for almost 30 years. This is the first time I've ever done this. This is a big deal to me, guys. I'm outdoors for a change. And I love it. Oh, I wish I brought my sunglasses, though. I gotta get out. I gotta get out and check this out. Here I am. There's eggs all over this island. You say you can't find seagulls eggs? I just did. I want to get out of here. I don't want to disturb them. I don't want to disturb their eggs. Even to go back to get another picture. That was awesome. I know it was just a little island, but I've been wanting to go on that island for about 30 years now. Kids used to swim out to it when I was a kid with their inner tubes, and I never had the guts to do it. And when I got older, I still wasn't a very good swimmer, so I still didn't have the guts to do it. I have no idea what I'm fishing for. I don't know what comes in here. If trout comes in. I see trout feeding in the morning, like really early in the morning. I think my best bet to getting a trout here is to go out with some flies early in the morning, right in twilight. I don't know what I was hoping to catch there. Well, if you take your fishing pole out in Lake Michigan, you better do at least one cast, right? Let's see if we can capture the sunset tonight.
If this was a survival situation, I know where to get a bunch of eggs at. And that's right there on that island. Seagull eggs. But it's not a survival situation. It's probably against federal law to take seagull eggs off a nest. Just saying, they were there. It looks like the seagulls don't even try to hide their eggs when they're in an island away from everybody. Those nests were just right out there on the rocks. I guess there's nowhere to hide them out there. Safe spot though for them. Well, I'll tell you what, my crappie fishing techniques are not working for trout. Go figure. Thought they might. Of course, I guess when you got a lake as big as Lake Michigan, you got to find where the fish are. They're, they probably aren't everywhere. Probably the 80-20 rule is probably real accurate with the fish in Lake Michigan too. 20% of the lake has 80% of the fish. And if you're in the 80% of the rest of the lake, you probably aren't going to catch any fish. Now, I don't know where those locations are in this lake. I probably never will. I'm 52. There's a lot of inland lakes that I plan on exploring. And uh, Lake Michigan kind of frightens me a little bit, and I just can't see myself exploring too much of it. Even if I got a bigger kayak. But I would love to catch a fish on Lake Michigan right now on that sunset. What is up with that sunset, man? I don't know. I like it. Dude, it's like everything's purple. It is. Purple haze. <laughs> Look at that. That's just absolutely beautiful. Well, that was fun. I didn't catch any fish. But I got to watch a cool sunset. I got to go out on the island. It feels awesome getting outdoors for a change. <laughs>